Why teach in Korea? First effects. Two thirds of South Koreans aged 25 to 34 have a college degree and take mandatory English classes. Koreans are obsessed with education to enable the best future for their children. South Korea provides top salary to their teachers and has the highest average reading literacy of the OECD. Salary for foreign English language teachers. English teachers in Korea can expect to make between $1,300 and $3,000 per month. Depending on the type of educational institution, the salary varies enormously. Public schools. 1.5 to 3 million won or 1265 US dollars and 2500 US dollars per month. Private language institutes between 1.9 and 2.3 million won or between 1600 US dollars and 1940 US dollars per month. Universities between 2.3 and 3.5 million won or between 1950 US dollars and 2950 US dollars per month international schools between 1.8 and 2.8 million won or 1519 US dollars and 2363 US dollars per month how much does it cost to live in korea how far exactly will your salary get you in Korea? Most teachers can put away quite a good portion of their salary. Even with a salary of 1,900 US dollars per month, you can live quite comfortably when teaching in South Korea. So, how much should you expect to spend while teaching in Korea? Rent. About 400,000 won. Or 750,000 won. Schools usually provide housing or monthly stipend. Phone and internet, 60,000 won. Dining out, about 6,000 won for a lunch out. Budget about 300,000 won for eating out per month. You can expect to spend around 1,100 US dollars each month while living in South Korea as a teacher if your school pays for housing. Where to teach in Korea? Most foreigners settle in Seoul, the country's capital, or Busan, the second largest city in Korea. However, you can find charming cities all across the peninsula. The number of expatriate English teachers hailing from English-speaking nations has increased from less than 1,000 in 1988 to over 20,000 in 2002 and stood at more than 22,000 in 2010. Adding these numbers to around 30,000 United States military personnel and civilian employees means you can always find foreign friends to hang out with, no matter where you are in Korea. Korea as a tourist destination The Korean wave, Hallyu, is overflowing the West, with K-pop and K-dramas being more popular than ever. At the same time, the number of foreign arrivals in South Korea has increased from 8.7 million in 2010 to over 14 million in 2014. Most tourists travel to the three best-known places, Seoul, Busan, and Jeju Island. Even though Korea is quite a small country, it is a country rich with history and culture. Korea is divided into nine provinces. North Chuncheong, South Chuncheong, Gangwon, Gyeonggi, North Gyeongsang, South Gyeongsang, Jeju, North Chola, and South Chola, each of which is more unique than the next. How about visiting the famous royal tombs of the Joseon dynasty? Or stop by one of Korea's historic villages of Yangdong or Hahue? Don't forget about the volcanic island and lava tubes of Jeju. Pamper your plate. Welcome to Gimchi Land. I guarantee you will never find a table without Gimchi on it. In case you don't know what it's all about, Gimchi is a traditional fermented Korean side dish made of vegetables with a variety of seasonings. 
Unique to Korea, almost every meal comes with a variety of side dishes called banchan that accompany rice and the main dishes. Traditionally, Korean dishes are mostly spicy and flavorful with fermented red chili paste, gochujang, and pepper flakes. Be sure to try the following most popular dishes. Bibimbap, gimbap, Korean barbecue, tofu stew, raw beef, and don't forget Korea's most popular alcoholic drink, soju, Korean rice schnapps.